And welcome, it's Friday night, and it is the Sit and Go Challenge here. We got Jack Six to start things out, and we're going to just fold that. So, All right, well, welcome to this. So what we're going to do is we're going to hit the intro and come right back. Boy, last night's Sit and Go was Donkey Damn City, but... Boy, was it fun. We ended up winning last night. We get here tonight. I got some big news regarding the Sit and Go Challenge. We're going to get into that in just a few minutes. Uh, also, we're going to probably try to have a cash game this weekend sometime. I'm going to do a different kind of cash game, so we'll see how that goes. Just make sure you tune in to Brand Poker TV right here on YouTube. You follow us on Twitter at poker underscore stud 83 you can find us on facebook at facebook.com slash brandon turner poker and they're getting on to it and all in and we got one going already seven deuce against kings and seven deuce is going to knock pocket kings out we've got our donkey of the night low ball 78 already the donkey of the night seven deuce and then flops two pair I don't know. Well, I didn't see the pre follow action, so I don't know if there was a raise or re-raise or anything like that. So I didn't wasn't paying too much attention to that. So she she may not be the donkey of the night, or we don't know. We really don't have no clue. We're going to check it here. We got no spade, so we will be folding. Last night I had my buddy Trent on. We're going to try to have him on a little more often. And a couple of my other friends. We're going to just mix and match it up and uh, have some uh, different kinds of stuff going on. We're going to have a couple of different, my friends are going to call in while I'm playing the sit and goes, our tournament, our cash game. We're going to have somebody sit in on it. So whatever happens, uh, happens. So we'll see how that goes. Oh, we get some, there's some betting asses right now, 400 into a a little over $300 pot, so I was over a bit the pot, but they take it down from low ball of 78. It's Ascension, Assassin, so I don't know what you want to say that is. All right, we got six, seven, I'll sit, we're going to fold. We already have one eliminated, one gone, and we've only been on the air for two minutes and 31 seconds. And we've already got one, one gone. It was all because a low ball 78 hitting two pair with sevens and deuces to knock out pocket king, so... No ill will towards the pocket kings. They played, I guess they played right up. Like I said, I didn't see the pre flop. They didn't raise pre flop, then they deserved what they got. You, If you let a donkey into your world, they will come. That's why when you know that you've got pocket kings and you limp in, you better be weary because there's a lot of things that can happen. You just got to know how to play them and know when to lay them down. On well, that situation, I would not have put my opponent on seven deuce, but that's what happened. And guess what? He's gone. All right. Oh. Let me see what I can do here. Cause do not have this table lined up. So look at that. All right. Let's see what we're gonna do. We're gonna fold. Nine, four. Okay. All right. So everything is situated now. We're good to go. Hmm. But yeah, I mean, if you, if you limp with kings, you're you're just asking for trouble. Now I've done it before, but I knew when to lay them down if I had to lay them down. So that's that's the difference. You've got to learn how to lay a big hand like that down. If you're gonna learn, if you're gonna play it like that, you're gonna have to learn how to lay it down. Uh, and you can't be mad at seven deuce if you limped in with pocket kings and seven deuce flop two pair. You can't be you can't be pissed about that because that was your fault. Uh, oh, I'm getting a attachment from one of my friends here. Wish I could have made it. Oh, there's invite me. Ah, uh, hmm. Okay, we got nine deuce. The only men raised it will limp in. Flop of nine. Yeah, they invited me to a home game night. I just couldn't make it. Uh, there's a bet, so we'll just call, see what's going on here. Okay. We've got nine deuce. All 
right, we're just gonna smooth call him. I don't know what he's got. Right, if he's just if he's betting eighty, we're probably gonna call the eighty. Yeah, he lays down two hundred. We'll probably call and see what we got. He didn't have nothing. He had ace queen high, so we called him down with nine deuce and one. I don't recommend you do that, but I just I had a feeling he didn't have anything, so. That's why I mean he just men he was men betting pretty much the whole way, and then he wants to put a two hundred dollar bet on a seven on the river. Seven didn't change anything, so that's why I called. If he'd have had the king, I figured he'd have bet more uh, ahead. So I just didn't see the reason why he would be doing that with ace queen. I mean, I would have got away from it if I thought he had uh, had a king, but I just didn't believe he had a king. I thought our nine was good. I was worried about a kicker, but other than that. I was gonna call that any time on the feeling or on that feeling anyway. Because I just didn't think he had it. He's probably sitting there cussing us, calling us a don't, but it was dumb how he played ace queen there. He min raises eighty, okay, with ace queen. You need to at least do three times the big blind or more if you want to get people out of there. So we were we we already had forty involved. So we called the forty. We flop a nine. It was a weak flop with a king. He bets, they fold, we call. Okay. Then he ups the bet from 40 to 80 the next round. Then he all of a sudden just puts 200 out there trying to steal the river on a seven when we knew we had a higher card than a seven. So that's why we called. Donkey plays. Okay, we got a gut shot. We hit a nine, we got a jack high straight. We hit a nine and a queen and we got Oh, we're going to fold. We're going to let them happen. Yeah. Board pairs. So that's 10, 7, 8, 8. We're, we're good. We're out. We're glad we're out. We'll let these two. Ace, Ace Assassin. We'll let him take care of it. With Low Ball over here, who's a big donkey, I believe. We'll find out more on the night if they're as big a donkey as we say they are. Playing 7 deuce the way they did. But... I just didn't see the, I didn't see the whole thing, so I really can't. I'm, I'm going from different perspectives. You you saw it. I'm not. I can't go back and watch it right now. So you can watch it. We're gonna call his 400, 360 more. All right, no queen, no jack, and we will pick up the pot and knock out our court fifty three thousand. He's gone. He was a donkey for sure. So now we're up to 18, 20 in chips already with two people gone. I mean, we've only been doing this for eight minutes. We've been doing this for under 10 minutes, and we've knocked out two people already. Could be three right here. We'll see what low ball sunk, sunk in with here. Let's see if she's going to call. Nope, she folds, so he picks up 100 off of that. All right, we got queen six off in the big blind. See what Trump you is going to do. He's going to just call, so we're going to check. We're not going to get really got nothing to. All right, we got a queen. We'll pot it here. So what Trump you does is going to fold. We're going to take that pot down, and we're going to move on to the next hand. Uh, we got 10 5 off suit. Uh, depending on what Trump U does, is what we're going to do. We're probably going to just sneak in, and if it's raised, we'll probably just let it go. Okay, we didn't flop anything on that. So we're going to fold. And we're going to try to. Trying to open it up more so you can see the players' names. I had to cut out a little bit. We're going to go with pocket threes here. All right. And we're going to get a raise, a min raise. Okay. So we got one call, one call. 
And we got everybody calling and all four in this hand, and we do not flop a set, so we're probably more than likely out of this hand. Okay, we are, we're out. We're going to let low ball probably dunked in there with 9 4, so. Ace four gonna take low ball to the house there. That's what you get for playing bullshit, low ball. So low ball is a don't. Well, I mean, gosh, I guess not. I mean, it was her, it was raised to eighty. She had forty in there, so she called the forty. So I don't know. I just I, I'm, my assessments on her is I don't know if she's a donkey or not. Kind of looks like she is. But you really just don't want to push it too much right now. We're right. We're sitting here. All of us sitting here with a possible halfway decent stack. We're barely in the lead right now. I'm gonna see what Trump you does. He calls a kind of making us obligated to call. Okay, eight nine eight board. We're gonna check. Assassin will bet. We'll fold. All right. We are not calling no more. Okay. No, we could have hit a low end of a straight here. Oh, we got a call. Nine three against sevens full. An ace assassin. Trump, you has come from be from beyond the grave to uh, to take the chip lead. What a what a comeback that is. So we're gonna just slump in here. She's gonna check. Low ball is. Hmm. We got a backdoor flush draw, but I'm not really excited about that. We'll let that go. So, monster. Jack seven five or Jack seven king. Let's call in our hand seven five. I don't know about Ace. Of, I don't know about any of these except for Trump. You, I mean, he just seems to be showing up with hands. I don't know if he's a donk or if he's just. Oh, here we go. See what's going to happen. Over betting a pot means he's probably got a pair of kings with a, either a weak kicker and just trying to take the pot where it's at. Jeffrey Dahmer hand. We're going to let it go. Mm, would have had a jack with a redraw to a heart flush, but mm. assassin folds, ace assassin folds. Let's see what Trump is going to do. Uh oh, Trump you says let's play ball. Shoves all in over the top. Must have the ace of hearts. No, he has the king of hearts, and that's enough. It's going to knock out low ball. The donk from hell is gone. And Trump, you is trumping everybody right now. So we're going to have our work cut out for us when we get heads up here in just a second. A6, we got two pair. No eight on the river, and we're good. And we're good with aces. I mean, six is full of aces, so we're heads up with Trump. You, we have cashed for the second night in a row. Now we have seven deuce. We're going to let Trump you have that. So we have cashed here on this beautiful Friday night right before the weekend and a day before the Alabama rolls over Florida State. Because tomorrow night, Alabama will stomp Florida State's ass. Promise you that. We got some good college football coming up. I can't wait. I'm ready for some college football. Been waiting eight months for it. We're gonna fold and let him have it. He probably got a flush. Not gonna attempt that. We gotta 
We had a pair of kings, but we're not tripping up. Every time Trump shoved all in, he's had the shit. We're not, not getting involved with it. Yeah, you can have that too. We want you to do that shove in when we when we got something. I got ten days we're gonna fold that. I tell you what, this this sit and go has it's fifteen minutes long right now. Okay. It's fifteen minutes long right now. And everybody's gone except for me and one other guy. Usually this is not how it works. We're gonna check that. He's gonna check it. We have nothing to go on here. We just got ace high. And he had a pair of fours. So if hearts would have come, we would have we would have busted it. We'd have wouldn't have busted him, but we would have got a double up to him. So Alright, we got two pair here on the flop. We're gonna bet 180 out there and take it down. King 10 off. I'm trying to see how he's playing because if he's gonna play tight, we're gonna try to steal some pots from him. Like right now. We'll just take these little $60 ones for right now and try to build our stack a little bit, patting us down. We got eight down off. He just calls. I mean, this this has been a quick Friday night single. I've enjoyed this one. Watching all these donkeys at this table. And they, actually, I believe it come down to the two best players on the that started on the table. I really do. So, not just saying Trump's a good player because he's got all the chips. I'm just saying he's he, I've seen him make some good calls. I mean, he's really trapped them and he's really got them in there and We've just hung in there long enough to, to uh, we've hung in there to get to heads up. We've cashed again this tonight, so that's always a good deal. He's gonna call the, that, but we got queen eight, so we got a gut shot here. Not sure if we want to bet it or not, but we're gonna try it. And he's gonna fold, so we're gonna take that down. That's what we want to do. All right, we got Jack Five off suit. Jack off suit. He's gonna fold to us. Okay, we'll take that. We'll take that any day of the week. Okay, we got King Eight. Raised up to 180. We're trying to just. We're trying to build us a stack. We don't really want him to call that much. But, hmm. And if he comes out betting, we gotta fold. Let me check. So we gotta check. All right. We got an open ender. And he's going to shove all in, so I'm not going to risk it on the open ender. All right, we got pocket fives, and we're going to raise it to 180. He calls. All right, we got two pair. We're going to make it at 880 again to go. I mean, if he had a nine, I think he would have probably already shoved in. All right, he's got to, he's got to have something here. We're gonna, yeah, there it is, the queen. He hit the queen. Nope, he didn't. We take that pot down with pocket five. So we got pocket jacks here. We're gonna raise it. He calls. We got all hearts. And we're going to bet 180 out. He's probably going to jam in on us. Yep. He's got the flush. And he's going to win. So, I mean, we were chasing a flush there ourselves. I didn't think he had a good flush, but we finished second. 
So we won last night. We cashed tonight. What a good Friday night it was. Uh, man, I'm ready for tomorrow night. I'm ready for football. That's what I've been waiting for all week. So it's time to play some football, so let's get ready. Uh, Alabama, Florida State tomorrow night. Yes, prime time. It's going to be a good one. SEC football is always the best. I don't care what anybody says, SEC football. And everybody, they sit there and say, oh, SEC this and SEC that. Who won nine national championships in a row? I believe. Or seven. Seven or eight national championships in a row. The SEC, the only team to do that is the SEC. So don't come here telling me that the SEC ain't no good. So back off. Yeah, Alabama lost the national championship last year, but we lost it to Dabo, baby. I mean, Clemson deserved it. They played their hearts out and they beat us. But we're still the tide, baby, and we're still going to roll. Anyway, this is the chosen one. Uh, we'll see you. Uh, hopefully, we'll have something to go tomorrow night. Maybe we'll get a cash game going. Till then, this is Brian Poker TV. We'll definitely see you Sunday for the tournament. Out.